What's good YouTube? This your boy Chi World back at y'all again with another video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that like button, comment, subscribe, make sure you click post notifications so you will be notified every time you budge out some heat. In today's video, instead of a vision board, I will be doing a visual board, meaning telling you guys what I want out of life as far as what I want to accomplish with my career and what things I want, like as far as just material things. I know like, I'm gonna go ahead and tell y'all, I'm gonna be flat out, what you call the word? Like not honest, but what you, not straightforward, what you call it? Ah! Well, I'm gonna be straight up honest out of everything, everything gonna be like real, what I want out of life. Whether it sound childish, or good i'm just being real with y'all if y'all like this video when it's over go ahead and hit that like button but let's jump right into it okay all the things i want out of life material wise like it's about to sound super ignorant but i really don't give a oh fuck you feel me look okay one thing i want to do personally man I want to get a grill, dog. I want, like, I want all this just to be VVS stock. Not not even VVS. I just want all this to be shining, man. And I might not keep it in for a lifetime. I might just get them, like, you know what I'm saying, keep it in for a while, then just go ahead and pull them out. I want permanent diamonds. I just want my junk to be shining because that's something I always... I always wanted a grill, but not no regular grill. I want a grill grill. You know what I'm saying? And just just like I can't even I can't even explain why I want it, man. It's just the culture. It's a culture thing to be for real. I always wanted a grill. So that's out of the material things, that's what I want. I want me a chain. We probably get creative game, or we gonna get the chi world with the little earth. You know what I'm saying? We gonna get that. Get me a Rolex. Not even a Rolex. I might get me a. Uh... Yeah, I'm gonna get a Rolex. We just gonna get a Rolex. Bust down. You know what I'm saying? I want a big boy house. Like a big old mansion. I want animals. Like a couple dogs. I want a Georgia Bulldog. I want some, probably a Great Dane. Pit Bull. A cat. And some crazy exotic animals, you know what I'm saying? Just like I'm a I'm an animal person, but I want to get them all like why they small, you know what I'm saying? So they all can like grow up and be used to each other. I want all my animals to be like family, like so I'm gonna get all of them while they small, and I'm gonna get them used to being around each other, so they all be peaches and cream. I ain't gotta worry about nothing. I want a big old parking garage with all the cars I ever wanted in life. I'm talking about from your Dodge Viper to your Jaguars to your Corvettes to your Ferraris to your McLarens to your G-Wagons. I just want a lot of and on my cars I want to express myself on everything I got. I want to be able to just paint my cars like my car, I want my cars to be like abstract, like where you just see my cars and even though they, they like very expensive cars, I want to have just like crazy paint on them. So just to say if I drive my car and I decide to auction my car off or sell it to a museum, it's going to be worth so much money because it's, it's going to be a limited edition car because you're going to have a car that's worth millions just because of the paint I put on it. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I just wanna I just wanna live my life 
how I want to live it. You know what I'm saying? Like, not really. I know you probably you probably hear a lot of things I say in my video and be like, man, that's crazy. That's stupid. But I'm not living to please you, man. I'm not living for nobody validation. I'm living for what's go what I think, at least what I think will make me happy. And I can't even say think or make me happy. I know it'll make me happy because it's, you get something you want, you work for it, and that's how you should live your life. You should, you should work for things you want. You know what I'm saying? So out of all the crazy, like that's that's crazy what I want. I know I want a nice house. I want some animals, some exotic, some not exotic. And you know what I'm saying? I'm going to take care of all my animals. I ain't going to just be like have them all in cages where you can... They ain't really living life. I want to have a big old, it's going to be a lot of land where they can just go out and do their thing. And you know what I'm saying? I'm going to have me, my cars. The main part, my favorite part of my house will be like a man cave. But the man cave is going to have everything in it from my art studio. It's going to have... uh. My music studio is going to have my my gaming area. It's going to have my my small theater set up so I can watch. Because I really love watching scary movies. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to have me a little theater room. I'm going to have me a little gaming room. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to have me a music studio because I love to make music. And another thing too was on my got to be done list. I got to make it big with my music you know what i'm saying so <coughs> i'm telling y'all all the things i'm really trying to narrow this video down i probably got to make a part two because there's a lot of things i want to do and accomplish before my last day on earth so it sounds crazy but i'm like i'm like man i'm finna i'm finna really do everything i i think about i want to do you know what i'm saying so <coughs> I'm going to have a big old crib. Just And then I know I'm going to have a lot of visitors. Like my family, I know they're going to come visit me a lot. And my spot probably be the spot where the whole family want to have family reunions at. Because I'm going to have a lot of things where the kids can come enjoy. You know what I'm saying? My nieces and nephew. And you know what I'm saying? My stepson and just everybody. I just want everybody to be able to enjoy things that I work for, you know what I'm saying? Because that's what it's about. I want to be able to create memories and at the same time, while I'm doing all these things I truly want to do, I want to be an inspiration to people who really want to do it. They truly want to do what they like, but they living in fear. I want to break people out of their fear because they see me and by me sharing this video with y'all and y'all witnessing me say this and i really make all this happen i hope that be like dang well shoot i'm finna do this and i'm really gonna make that happen and i ain't gonna stop till i really make that happen another thing i want to do i want to like go around the world like egypt i just want to go china like i just want to go different places Eat foods from different cultures. I really want to go to the desert, ride camels with the turban on and the thing, the clothes to cover your mouth like this. And I want to see the pyramids and all that and probably shoot a music video out there. I just want to go around the world, man. I want to live life like it's basically like GTA without the killing. That's how I want to live life. Because you know when you get on GTA, you be like, man, I'm finna fly to the city. I'm finna get in this jet, go here. I'm finna go over there. I'm finna go to this side of the map. I want to do that in real life. I want to just be able to get up, uh, rent a plane, put my whole family on that, everybody bringing their cameras, and create memories with people, with my family, with you guys, the people that support me, that, that want to learn from me. Like when I touch down in your city, and I'm telling you, once I hit this level of wealth, y'all ain't got to worry about nothing. I'm talking about if I land in your city and I'm having an art show, y'all going to be able to come in for free. I ain't going to charge y'all for none of that. Uh, if, But it will be like 
a limit like first come first serve cuz I you know what I'm saying you know like with the hazard and all that but when I come to your city be ready to grab them tickets cuz they will be gone out before they sold out because when I touch down in your city we're gonna have a good time man we're gonna chill we're gonna create we're gonna eat us some snacks and we're gonna share inspiration with each other man we're gonna motivate each other and do things like that but yeah like that's that's all I want man out of life I want to um the first thing I want to do when I get rich I know it's like the typical thing everybody do but I sincerely want to get me a place and I want to get my mom a place I want to get my parents a place I want to get them a spot Somewhere where they like it and I want to pay it off and I want just uh I want them to be so like excited that that happened because I always told them For the longest like that's something I'm gonna do So that's really a goal of mine and that's part of my motivation too because I really want to make that happen because I It just like when I was coming up before I started my YouTube channel and I really didn't know what to do with my life i knew i had talent but i just didn't know how to make it work for me but they was always supportive and i know everybody ain't blessed with people like that in their life some people got people in their ear telling them uh you should do this or you should you are wasted or you should go to school why you not and you got some people that's not believing in what you truly want to do and they believing in what they want you to do but my parents never been like that. They always been like, it's been times where I be in my room and my dad will just come in there and he'll just randomly say, I'm proud of you. But it was around the time I felt like, dang, I ain't do nothing for you to be proud of me about. But they always like believed in me even when I didn't believe in myself. So when pe when you got people like that in your life, you that's something you will never forget. You know what I'm saying? So. I want to do something very special for my parents. And y'all going to be able to witness because we going to, the day I do it, we're going to rewind this little clip and we're going to play this little clip. And then we're going to fast forward it to the now and the now where I will be making that happen for them. And really, man, personally, that's all I want for myself out of life as far as material things. You know what I'm saying? And then, you know what I'm saying, with my life, I want to be, I want to have a big family, personally, a lot of kids, a wife, damn, and I just want to chill, man, I just want to do art for the rest of my life, I want to try to, because then you got to think, I see life like this, when I die, it's a wrap, it's no mochi creating art, so, I want to try to use every drop of talent God got in me, man. Like, I want to use that to the fullest. I want to have, like, a million pictures drawn by me before I pass. And then I truly feel like if I die, I die in peace because I know, man, I done, I did everything I could do. I done, I drew everything, and I done inspired so many people in a positive way. I want to inspire people in a positive way. I don't want to, if something negative about me, I don't want it to brush off on anybody. I want it, I want to inspire you in a positive way. So if I ever fuck up in life, cause I'm not perfect, and I wind up getting big, and you know how celebrities get big, and as soon as they do something stupid, they try to, they try to focus on that and share that to the world. Just know that if that ever happened to me, I'm human, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm not perfect, but I was trying to show or uh, be the best person I could be, even though with my flaws. You know what I'm saying? I want y'all only to get the good qualities of me. I don't want y'all to get none of my bad habits or nothing bad I do. If I blow up and I start falling off and messing up, that's when I want y'all to stop, like, really looking up to me. You know what I'm saying? Or, or all that. I want y'all to just, you know what I'm saying? And do that with everybody in life. Try to take the good qualities of people. Because everybody on this earth, not perfect, man. You know what I'm saying? So, 
try to learn from the good qualities you like out of people and you piece that together and you make you you know what I'm saying so that's how I do it but man that's pretty much a, uh, it's so much I want out of life man and you know what I'm saying so if I think of some more junk to just talk y'all ear off about we will be having part twos, part threes, part fours. You know what I'm saying? But I appreciate y'all for listening to me. Run my mouth as always. I'm dropping some art videos back to back. I will be vlogging back to back for you guys. Make sure you stay tuned. Mohi coming soon. And I'm out.